Guys, the Meg was, I mean, ridiculous, fun, crazy sharks. Uh, a childhood fear of mine. When I grew up, I thought sharks were gonna be a way bigger factor. I thought, it, I thought for sure that was how I was going out. So I'm curious, like, when you guys maybe growing up, or maybe even now, is there any, like, maybe threat, natural disaster, animal, giant shark? Bigfoot, I had a Bigfoot problem growing up. I have an experience. When I was uh, snorkeling above the water, I saw the shark just swim under, under, under the water. I was really worried about the Sasquatch and it, it, it turned out I, it didn't affect me at all. No, no, listen, don't do anything. I've, I learned to surf when I came to California. I mean, there's lots of seaweed in the ocean That's there true. and you get a bit of that dangling around the feet. It's safe. They won't go up and bother you. They won't go up and bite you, no. You, it's amazing what you can put in your head. Usually it's a shock. So. I don't have that for you. I feel like it probably is relevant, but my mum spent most of my childhood warning me about having a, like a knife or a fork near the toaster, like anything metal near the toaster, <laughs> and she also made a really big deal out of me blow drying my hair anywhere near a sink. I get scared in really in small places, like hearing about the rescue of that soccer team, that and they had to yeah. go through like these apertures with w rushing water going through, I mean, oh my gosh. For three that's, hours or whatever That's it was. absolutely terrible. That's crazy, those guys are brave, man. Also entertainment reporters. Yeah, we are. We can, I mean, we're a real threat. You have to deal with. Terrifying. I'm bringing you the hard-hitting questions.